The FBI Director, Homeland Security Secretary, Director of National Intelligence and the National Security Advisor make a rare appearance together. They warned that foreign powers, notably Russia, are persistently trying to undermine the United States. What we are seeing are the malign influence operations, in effect information warfare that we've talked about, and that didn't really, that's a 24-7, 365 days a year phenomenon. They said that while November's midterm elections were under threat, the campaign of misinformation was not as robust as what they saw during the 2016 election. Russia has used numerous ways in which they want to influence uh, through media, social media, through bots, through actors that they hire, through proxies, uh, all of the above and potentially more. Although officials were vague about what countermeasures they were putting in place, they said President Trump had directed them to aggressively confront the threats. Facebook said earlier this week that it removed 32 pages and fake accounts which were part of a political influence campaign targeting the midterms, though they didn't mention Russia. Last week, Democratic Senator Claire McCaskill announced that Russian hackers attempted to infiltrate her Senate computer network as she started her midterm campaign. The top Democrat on the Senate Intelligence Committee tweeted that he wished what was said at the conference was backed up by the president. At a summit with Vladimir Putin last month, Donald Trump initially seemed to accept Putin's denials of election meddling and has repeatedly asserted that the idea of Russian interference is a hoax. National Security Advisor John Bolton defended what he called President Trump's decisive action against meddling.